I am late. I'm so sorry. It's one of these days. Well, but I'm here now. What is the time? It is 7.43. And let's see who is here tonight. I have my blue light. <laughs> Yes, so that's what's up. Uh, barely made it a long day and all of that. But, you know, still come in here and see if anybody is tuning in tonight and joining my Thursday live stream. And then, and then we see what's up. So right now we have two in the live stream. Let's see who is coming in and joining the live tonight. I'm late, I know. Truck life, I can always count on truck life. Truck life, pick up yourself. This is so cool. Um, truck life, how was your day? It's it's hot, very hot in Kingston. So, and then we have Poleon Elf greetings, Ansar Shabas fashion model. Hi, greetings. Good night. Good to see you all. Lenworth from Vancouver. Nice, nice. Michael Mariner, greetings. And this looks like a diver. Michael, I love your your picture there. That looks like you're free diving there, going down the line. Am I saying that right? It's very small. <laughs> Let me know, Michael. Brimdark, greetings from Ohio, USA. This is so cool. People tuning in night. And we are on my Thursday night live stream every week. Jay, greetings. And then we have Truck Life says, my day was good. Got a lot done. How was your day, Chess? You know, my one was... Okay. <laughs> I had to go to the dentist again. So it looks like I'm just working for the dentist. That's kind of the story of my life, but well, thank you. And yes, yes. Okay, nice, nice. Michael, where are you, where are you diving? You're in Jamaica? You're in Jamaica, my girl? <laughs> well, go on, Don Dada. Greetings. Dave, Thursday takes so long. Oh, Dave, thank you. <laughs> <laughs> I, I have my blue light again i'm not sure uh last week this light is new light so you guys i have a little better lighting here it it stayed with us for 10 minutes so let's see how long it will go this time remember yes truck life tell them guys remember give this video a like 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 it like right now give it a like give it a like because it's Thursday and we all made it this evening to the live stream. So isn't that great? We have Travon Edwards. Greetings from New York. Nice. And we have Rocketman. Greetings. Jay. What did the dentist say? No, man. The dentist said, come back tomorrow. <laughs> That's how bad it is. So, yeah. It's not even like how much for your car? My car goes for nine fifty. Negotiable. <laughs> yes. Um Sharonet, hi singing from New York. Greetings, Sharonet. Looks good. I watched your last video spearfishing. What was the name of the fish you caught? The one with the thick skin. So that's a file fish. And it's the same family as the trigger fish. So some people were saying it's a trigger fish, but it's actually a file fish. Uh, scribble file, to be very exact, a scribble file fish. So yes. And this, the file fish, the trigger fish, the puffer fish, they're all from the same family yeah so yeah and so this the skin or skin fish so the skin is like leather it is so tough so while i was skinning the fish i was like does this taste good <laughs> because if you see the skin you'll be like having maybe some doubts but but you know 
Chris, he said it's a good tasting fish. And I know some other people already said it's a good tasting fish. So I'm like, hey, I caught it. I'm going to prepare it. <laughs> so yeah, guys. So um, if you haven't seen that video after this live stream, you can check out my last video. I cooked. So I cooked and I cooked, I cooked what I caught and I caught a file fish and uh, I have never skinned a file fish and I have never prepared. So all of that was the first time in my last video. And it actually came out very nice. I could have invited you all like it was ready to serve for guests. You could have been all my guest people. It, yes. Yes. You know, sometimes you cook and, and it's better you alone eat it. <laughs> I have sometimes days like this but this one yeah man yeah man yeah man it really it really turned out very nice the steam fish so i steamed it with with what did i have it oh i had some rice right what's the vibes for this weekend okay we're going to a river so river and maybe i would love to go diving of course so i will see if i can go diving as well but definitely a river is included this weekend. So I've never been to that river. So guys, look out for that. You know, I'm chasing waterfalls. And so you can look out for another cool waterfall. Well, I haven't been there, but yeah, it must be nice. Yeah, yeah. It will be nice. It's an adventure. <laughs> um, that food looked like, yeah, man, it was really nice. Wagwan, I'm from the USA. I'm diving in Palm Beach, Maryland, Florida, anywhere. Ooh, that's so cool. You know, actually, Michael, that's one of my, um, it's on my bucket list to dive in Florida. Yes, I've seen so many cool dive spots, which I would love to check out. And then also, I would love to link up with that guy. He's also a YouTuber and he do spear fishing. So definitely would want to do that as well somewhere in the future <laughs> for now i need some more practice you know but i'm working on it i'm working on it randy morgan jesse love your videos enjoy them so much from randy from st louis greetings papsy hey papsy in the house papsy are back in london osh 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 <laughs> sending you some jamaican sunshine and heat <laughs> to london nice nice fapsi big up yourself guys fapsi also a youtuber right here i'm gonna show it right here greetings from london so fapsi has a youtube channel and he also made a video from lover sleep go check it out and he got some wicked drone shots yes <laughs> i know some guys you guys were telling me i should have had a drone but i didn't but that's okay because fapsi on his vlog has some nice drone shots from lover sleep yeah man that's what's up simone greetings hey which you and false um you know i have i'm not sure uh, this this one actually is not organized by me <laughs> so i'll have to get the name but it's in saint anne i don't know that much it's in saint anne um and the blessed love from dominica nice aj andy greetings lenward what was the weight of the snapper that your diving partner caught that was a big one yo that was huge huge I mean, when I held it out of the water, I was like, like, it should have sent my feet like they're flopping <laughs> to get him out of the water. It was heavy. But I don't know. I don't know. Eight pound? I don't know. I don't know. I don't know. Um, no idea. I have to, I have to ask him. Um, but heavy. Next time we'll be diving together when I'm back in Jamaica. Yeah, man, Fapsi absolutely bring your bring your gears next time bring your mask your fins and we go diving <laughs> yeah that would be cool that would be cool we could do a catch and cook and depending on your we'll work it out depending on your your um like how deep you want to go diving <laughs> but we can do also a wilkes you know go for wilkes which is like more on the shore or we can go like out, out, out. <laughs> yes, man, we can definitely do that, Fapsi. 
And um, yeah, Fapsi, you know what I thought? You're gonna have, you, you never recorded anything from going up, back up. I was looking out for that part because I, I missed that part of your group. <laughs> I was looking out for that struggle. You left it out, man. <laughs> because, you know, I was wondering if I really did justice to both sides of the experience, you know, because I was like, yeah, okay, Fapsi will cover some of the, the, the that leg. Yeah, man, Shermel, greetings, Jimmy. Hi, have you been to Westmoreland, Jamaica Coast? Yeah, man. well, I've been to Westmoreland, but not diving. I've been to, I've been to some amazing waterfalls in Westmoreland, like, um, what's your name? um what's the name ah, i forgot there are two waterfalls there well they have more but it, it will soon get back to me um yeah man simone definitely barrington hi from barry in london look here guys we have people in london from london in the chat and i know it's late over there it yeah past midnight am i right or wrong very, very, Michael, I'd love to dive with you if you ever come to Florida. Michael, yeah, man, yeah, man, absolutely. Whenever I make it, definitely want to link up with other divers, you know. Um, especially, guys, like, you, you know, your spots and where to go and, you know, your no, you know, it's just your ends. <laughs> so definitely that would be very cool. Hi, good night. Love your videos and good job. Bevan, thank you. So good. Bevan a Baptist. Guys, if you too, if you just tune in, remember to give this live stream a like because that will help me. <laughs> it will help the video and all of that. Yeah, man. So yeah. Um so yeah guys i can't wait until i myself can shoot a big snapper but you know guys it's almost two o'clock you see wow 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 yes but too many people was dropping out like flies <laughs> so didn't want to show it funny though yo I, I really thought you're gonna have at least a little bit like some of the i'm not sure or were they just joking like basically after and we're not that joking like at when it when they were hiking but yeah man i was looking out for some of that drama <laughs> but okay got you got you yes linward benta river that was i was looking for and mayfield falls exactly so i went to both of them and there's a video on my channel of benta river beautiful mayfield falls beautiful oh my god mayfield falls that was i was i was laughing my ass off it was so funny because we were putting that mud all over us and we just looked so ridiculous and man there's a video on the channel it was funny it was really funny and of course it's just beautiful guys i highly can recommend to visit Benta Falls and Mayfield Falls and I went to Ro Roaring River yeah I went to Roaring River actually that video has not been uploaded yet but it's coming it's coming because I was in the grill the other day so you know I tried to see what else I can do and then I went to Roaring River with the team of Throp yeah man so me, Throp, and his team went to a Roaring River, and uh, it was really beautiful. We had a cookout there. So, guys, look out for that video. Grace is, hey, greetings. Jess, Canada is ice fishing. Good night. How are you? I'm good, you know. Every day, I just, you know, we just have to remind ourselves, we just give thanks. Even if things maybe sometimes not really go the way we wish and things right now are a little crazy. We just have to always kind of be able to put things into perspective. And, you know, and that will help to say, you know, we have a give thanks, you know. 
and 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 then sometimes just remind all of the good things and then go to bed with a good thought i love it <laughs> yeah man simone absolutely worth it um i i liked both of them yeah they're 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 pretty and roaring river is nice as well and um actually i have to go back to roaring river because there's a there's a new attraction there which i want to cover and um highlight in my video so i'm going to go i'm, I'm going to go back there and anyways i want to go back to negril <laughs> and do some more diving on that end um because it was so spontaneous i mean i had my gears with me because i was like hey i'm ready if there's a possibility i'll go but i didn't know anybody and you know in a grill i could go with but then when i was there you know it turns out that the, the person who came actually to the cookout junior he's like i'm a spear fisherman i'm like what <laughs> that's so cool can we go out let's go and he's like yeah man let's see and then eventually he said yeah man tomorrow morning see looks because it was a little overcast the weekend and then um actually the day where i had to leave is like you know we can go on a dive if it, if the weather is okay so he said yeah weather is okay and i went diving and then i was happy <laughs> yeah man that was so cool you see guys oh my god I, mm. so over there i could enter the water on a ladder that was like just so luxurious and over the weekend i was in portland i did another oh that's the one yeah the file fish video right so i uploaded that one but the day before the water was rough and murky and uh, it was so difficult to, to get into the water and swim out and these waves kept pushing me back and... <laughs> but that there is no video of that because there is no content um but i might do like a short video just to show you guys the other side you know it's not always the nice and pretty seas and the nice scenery sometimes it's just murky dirty wave current and you just hey watch 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 guys look at that yeah i got a super chat from super sticker from Va Fapsi, Fapsi. hey Fapsi, big up yourself high five jack yay love it this is so cool thank you so much i love to support guys oh my god you make my yeah look i got another coffee right here i love it from fapsi from the uk <laughs> thank you so much pick up yourself um when do you we are blessed in this island. Many can't have the things we do. Yeah, man, Simone, so true. Are you going back to Switzerland? And if so, would you bring us along with you? So <clears throat> I actually planning for next year because um, for a family event, things are still in the very beginning and the very beginning of stage of planning. So definitely I will bring you guys along and show you guys some Swiss Alps. <laughs> Yo, that, no, guys, that I definitely will bring you along. Um, yes, so, but that will be next year and that's gonna be exciting. So yeah, so there's a family event which I will attend and, uh, you know, my, 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 my YouTube family, you know, now has to be wherever I am, right? So you guys definitely going to be with me and I'm already because I haven't been there for a long time. So I will be a tourist. Yeah, I will do tourist like things like tourists do <laughs> somewhat if I can afford it. More definitely maybe one or two things. So it's so funny. Sometimes, you know, when you live where you live, you sometimes don't explore your area as much as a tourist does. And um, so, yes, 
so now I see like certain things other people like tourists post and I'm like wow I never did that like wow I never been there so so I said when next when 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 I go back there's certain things I want to do like there's this mountain um like there's this restaurant it's in the mountains and it, it's very it's very unique um, if you Google mountain restaurant Switzerland, yeah, like it will come up because of the how unique it is. And it's a hike. So, you know, Team Trekkers has pre is preparing me, of course, you know, because <laughs> I've been trekking now with Team Trekkers for a while and that will be next year. So I definitely will be ready for some Swiss Alps hiking. Um, yeah. And you guys look out for that. Um, may I ask what zodiac sign you are if I'm not being too nice? No, man, you can ask because my birthday is this month. Yes, it's the 24th of June. I walk sideways. <laughs> That's my sign. You, you, you know it? Can you guess it? <laughs> Link me when you go in Roaring River. Yes, Simone, definitely. Um, yeah, 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 yeah. Because, well, this month is out because I'm traveling next next week, guys. You, yes, you win, right? You know. So next week I'm traveling. So the June is out, and then July is out as well. So Simone, most likely maybe in August. Yeah. Julie, happy Thursday, Jessica. How is Matt? Seriously, thought we love seeing you with Ratis. It's so pure pure the way you are with him he, oops uh oh here we go yes julie thank you so much like yeah man yeah man is is like i miss i miss him already like he is such a gem it's just you know working with children i've been working with children um in sports so you always you know i always appreciate when children you know are very in tune to nature and open you know absorbing information and are, are connected you know so that it's always a joy to see and definitely he's 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 on a good path so and i'm happy to see that i wanted to check his swimming skills but we didn't get to it so hopefully Next time I get can go up there, I can actually. Um, I really want to check on that because I didn't get the chance. Um, because you know, a lot of people here will be able to get from A to B, kind of style. But you you can also have really swimming techniques, so you will not get tired and you're very comfortable. So I really want to make sure that he actually gets the swimming technique so that he's very comfortable in the water and it's not, you know, treading water kind of style of swimming. So, yeah. But um, if I go back there, it's probably August or something. Or <laughs> I put everything to August. <laughs> I, hey, the amount of things I'm putting to August right now, August needs like eight weeks. Um, yeah somewhere there hopefully hopefully um yeah let's see um guillermo how do i put oh man i can't pronounce the name guillermo 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 mata guillermo is it spanish or french Thanks, you, thank you so much. Um, Guillermo, is it? Oh, man. Ah, Barrington, when are you going back to Sirati? Yeah, um, the plan is, um, I'm not sure. It Well, again, as I said, June is out. July is already out as well. So August, hopefully. Yeah, so excited. Definitely looking forward to that. Yeah, man, simply. Definitely, definitely. Um, I still have a video out, which which I'm going to upload. I'm, I'm, in, I'm editing now, and Fabsy just sent a coffee over here, so I can, you know, I'm not going to fall asleep, so I'm definitely going to put in an extra hour in editing. Um, 
So look out, I actually have another video coming from Ras Kitchen. Yes. Terry Lynn, greetings. And we have Salty Lux in the chat. Nice. Big up yourself, Salty Lux. How you doing? Salty Lux, I prepared a, a file fish for the first time. <laughs> Kingston, Canada. Blood Diamond. 472 greetings culture max my birthday is in august and i roar okay scrappy dan wagon greetings dj dino big up yourself julie it was awesome seeing you trek down lower sleep i i did it when i was in jamaica a few years ago and it took me three days to <laughs> i will invite you to join us when we are again in jamaica in august all right julie yes 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 um i heard i heard i heard people yeah were struggling days these um to get back to actually walking properly but uh, for some reason for some reason if you don't skip your leg days it's rewarding because the next day I was just like I never did anything, which I was almost a little like, come on, a little soreness. So like, <laughs> at least that I, I struggled. I struggled yesterday. Where's my soreness? <laughs> but nothing. I actually had a coffee tour. So I brought some guests to the mountains. I was like, back on hiking and I was like, oh my God, I'm going to manage walking through this coffee farm and blah, blah, blah. But I woke up the next day, get out of bed just like that, and nothing. Yeah. yeah. Thanks to my trainer <laughs> who making sure I'm not skipping leg days. So that's good. That's good because I have some more trekking adventure coming up. Um, yeah. I don't want to say too much because I'm not going. I'm not sure if it's actually happening, but. Something is coming. <laughs> yes. All right. So we have Hollywood today from Los Angeles. Nice. Hollywood greetings. Yo, that's so international here. Gobby, do facial and change your hairstyle and you will look so beautiful. Okay, Gobby, what like how you want my my oh you're talking about my eyebrows, right? Yeah, they need they need some. Yeah, man, they're, they're definitely, I could do my eyebrows. I see it. <laughs> Larry Lewis, it was good look. Jamaican YouTubers are one of the best. Can't wait to do a massive link up when I'm back. Yeah, man, Fapsi, Fapsi, when are you coming back? Huh? Send some dates. When are you coming so we can prepare? Maro, just checking in from Nova Scotia. Greetings. What's your favorite part of Portland? Well, every, well, I think like starting, honestly, starting from Port Antonio right up to Manchinil, the entire stretch is has a lot of great, great no, not it, no, long road, long road, yeah man. Everywhere there are nice spots, like the entire stretch. Mm-hmm. Julie says, we love you here in Toronto. Nice. Carpe diem. This to walk properly. <laughs> like this, so important. Carpe diem, I'm telling you. Um, I, and we have some people in the chat who did the same trek, so they can tell you some people definitely were sore. So, 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 sore. So, um, yeah, so that's what's up. Guys, show some support and hit the like button. Exactly. We have 46 people in the live chat whoop, whoop, whoop. on my Thursday live stream. That's so cool, guys, that you're joining in, spending the time with me right here on a Thursday night. That's so nice. Thank you. Give the video a like. I just love it. You guys are so cool. Good night from Trinidad. Greetings. You look like an innocent fox. <laughs> well, that's good. 
Salvatore, hello. Good night from Lima, Peru. Oh my God, Salvatore, I wanna. I hope it's on my bucket list to visit Peru. Yeah, 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 yeah. Wow, that's so cool. Salvatore in Peru, greetings to you. Culture Max says, what do you say about what, 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 who said that this woman is perfect looking already anymore because she loved to be an angel from heaven. Oh, thank you, Culture Max. Julie, have you ever done a mineral pass in St. Thomas? Well, I did it many times, but I have, I have not, like, I did not have vlog. When I was there, I wasn't even a YouTuber. But since I'm a YouTuber, I have not been to the mineral bath in St. Thomas. And one main reason is that the road is so terrible. Guys, right now, the road constructions which are happening currently in Portland is a nightmare. Yeah. So certain things are just put on hold. Um... Well, either there's a miracle and I get a nice SUV or there's another miracle and we get some good roads. So <laughs> I'm not sure what's going to happen first. Yeah, man. But yeah, I definitely want to go there. It's always, always, always vibes. And it's so cool, the hot water coming out of the rocks. Marcos Flores, greetings from Rastra Cruz, California. Greetings. Nice. This is so international. Oh my God, I love it. I love it. This is amazing. And guys, pick up yourself. Mm -hmm. So, yeah, man. So hopefully, I am not sure, but I really want to go diving. You see, guys, diving in jamaica i shouldn't say diving i should say spear fishing is is uh for beginners it is not easy because there is not a lot of opportunities so i i don't want to shoot juvenile fish right so it's and then it's just a big fish right so you and you'd only see them every now and then but when you do see them, you need to be on target and all of that stuff. So you never really get to practice. And that's why it, it's fairly, fairly a difficult. Um, because usually in anything, you practice by repetition, right? Repetition, 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 and that and, and so you become perfect. I have I have no repetition because I'll, we'll be swimming for hours and there is nothing, you know? And then there's this, by the way, the next video coming, you will, I'll actually slow down <laughs> some parts of the video just to show you guys what I missed and how I missed. Yeah, because sometimes you can also miss because the gun is not working properly. And just so many things can go wrong, you know, with that one opportunity. <laughs> so yeah but i love it i definitely i just have to get out there more and more and more and so i can get practice um yeah how do you like your refurbished spear fishing gun i love it i really really love it so it really fired nicely it like there was no itching from the line nothing it was just clean like check <laughs> so so that no now i can i have no excuse so if you know if i miss now it's not the gun's fault it's my fault <laughs> so before I, I could blame actually the gun um a lot so because it was a little faulty but now i just have to be on target um yeah but it, yeah so my first gun was floating and this one is not floating and they didn't tell me that they need this in the side so i bought it without the little plugs and now there's no plug and blah 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 anyway <laughs> so i'll see how it works without the uh, plugs so yeah because that can affect the gun as well you know if it's floating or if it's not floating so yeah terry and jessica you know alex keat no 
Who is that? Is a YouTuber? Dishes with Darren. Hello, greetings. Good to see you, Dishes with Darren. Papsi, Queen's UT in next four hours. Chat soon. All right. Pick up yourself. Thanks for tuning in, Papsi. The Taylor Farms, long time no see. How are you? You know, I think I need a photograph for Taylor Farms. You you available? You available? <laughs> you available on Monday? Not sure. I kind of need a photograph. I don't know. Um, yeah, you know, Taylor, I didn't thought of you. But now that I see you, maybe you could um, do that. Uh, good night from Atlanta. Nice. James Allen Cooper, how long you guys stay in the water before you get the catch? It's, it's good that you're asking that because my next video, I'm actually going to talk a little bit about the reality <laughs> because we're in there six hours. Anything between... No, I, I'm... Minimum. I never... I think the shortest dive there was four hours and probably the longest was about eight or nine hours. So, but the average is definitely six, eight hours we're diving. And you get a video. And mostly there's cooking as well. So the 20 minute video has maybe a six, seven minute dive. I get out of that for to edit everything else. Nothing is happening. Yep. Hey, it's not easy <laughs> to get those 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 catch is a lot of work, people. It's a lot of work. Pick up all the fishermen out there. So much respect. Pick up to you. If you're a fisherman right here, pick up, pick up, pick up yourself. Yeah, man. Hard work. Definitely. It's an art. Man, man, man. Aura Ashley, hey, what's up? Are you coming on Saturday? This is so cool. Taylor, I'm good. It depends on the time you're requesting. Um, I'm not sure. I probably I want to get the evening sun. So maybe, maybe, I don't know. You can inbox me or, did I? Is, is Taylor Farms, your Instagram, is it? No, I have you on my phone. I'm going to WhatsApp it. I'm going to WhatsApp you and we can take it from there. Yeah, man. Yeah, man, James, we're in the, we're out there hours, hours. Um, but you don't really feel like the time passing by, like sometimes coming out to the water and I'm like, what? So late, you know? And sometimes I would have still not go in because I was, you always like, oh, maybe, maybe now, maybe now, maybe now, maybe now, maybe the fish is there, maybe over there. So you're always hunting, hunting, searching, 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 observing, trying to get that one opportunity and, and the time just fly by. And there's a, there's a lot of distance we cover. Like, I don't even know how much miles of swimming maybe i have to I have to ask the guys one i have to ask them actually roughly how much miles we do yeah it's a lot yeah man hey first time they were like you sure you can manage <laughs> hey now they don't ask me again because now they know i can manage because <laughs> it's not like you know i don't want to slow them down so yeah yeah <laughs> yeah yeah, the evening would be good. I will link you on IG. Perfect. Yeah, man. So we can check. I can't make it on Saturday. Sorry. Have fun. Mm, all right. Or right. oh. Well, yeah, man. That's that's man. Really? But you have to be there. <laughs> Eight hours of fishing. Jeez. Yes, girl. Yeah, man. In there, in the water. That's why you know when 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 you're coming out of this water. Sometimes I am cold, and so and so hungry so hungry like i i i don't know whoever dives can relate like i don't know what's happening to your body but the way you are hungry after diving is 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 crazy because it doesn't seem like you are it's not like i'm i'm running a marathon and i'm sweating and i really you know realize 
how strenuous the act like the workout is. When you dive, you don't really feel it like you're burning or anything, you, you know, calories. You're just there floating around all the time, you know. But man, you could eat a cow. <laughs> when I when I come out of the water, I'm vegetarian, so I can't eat a cow. I could eat a tree. <laughs> Oh man, hey, NJ Nature, greetings, what's up? So guys, this is NJ Nature, check out his channel, another YouTuber, go over there, show him some love on his channel, some really good editing, like I have so much to learn, <laughs> I want to really get better, like over there, you have some nice footage, original content, um, I'm due with a for a link up with with NJ Nature Jamaica. So go over there and check it out. What? Last time I spent I went diving, I lost my sense of taste for three days. Really? Oh my God. That's why you 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 touched something which you shouldn't have. <laughs> yeah man you work an appetite full body workout yay hey sometimes i'm like no this is not real like <gasps> and spearfishing ain't no joke believe in it put a lot of strain into your body yes yes so i guess i guess the water and all of that stuff um and you always pushing your limit because you always you always pushing your limit because you want to dive longer and 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 eventually deeper and and to to get that one opportunity you know it's really fun i i just love the the but oh man i wish sometimes i could better show you guys the art of spear fishing there's so much coming into this because you have to you have to be vigilant because there's danger as well so, and you have to understand each fish has his own mimics. Like they're all different. Like understanding, for example, that big snapper, Kwesi, he, 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 he said, well, he assumed based from where we were coming that the only way he could actually go and hide would be over there. So he already had figured that out and really to me, outsmart that snapper. He went down there, expected the snapper to be in there, and he was in there. <laughs> so he shot the snapper um, in the little, uh, what do you call it? Cave, rock, hole, whatever. Yeah. I mean, if I would have anticipated that, that's something I could do as well, because that's, to me, something which I can probably easier manage than to to shoot a snapper in the open that i think is still quite difficult but now i have a better gun so <laughs> it's dehydration that's why you're hungry oh really so funny right you're surrounded of so much water and you're thirsty <laughs> yeah that, that's interesting i i really i i kind of do not understand why what what is causing the body to to burn so much calories are we just floating around <laughs> too much salt one man was in the four too long and it leaves good ah okay all right all right yeah and i stay no longer than one hour in the sea out again why ng the, the, one hour mm -hmm. that's hard we we out there between honestly never less than four hours four between four six seven hours just easily we usually jump off about i don't know sometimes nine ten and yeah we out by three four it's a full day yeah man guys there is work 
It's work. But they are professionals, so that's that's their job, you know. So they are they're there to work. They they you know. So so it's definitely hard work. Hey, hold on, hold on, hold on. It's getting really festive. Oh my god, this is so cool, guys. A high five, Emil Cruz. Pick up yourself. Oh my God, this is so cool. Thank you so much. Look here. I love it. Emil Cruz sent me a super chat. Nice. Happy smile. <laughs> Emil, pick up yourself. Ah, this is so nice. You know, I, of course, there's so much work going into this videos and um so yeah i appreciate i appreciate it thank you so much uh guys i'm afraid to lose my taste again you're not gonna lose your taste just just don't 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 drink the salt water <laughs> but again and the sun beating down you on this elements i guess i guess but it's 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 it takes time like you slowly getting better getting better you slowly stay longer you, you slowly for example i actually on that dive on the last video that's a new personal best i don't even know why i didn't say it in the video but yeah i should have but it was it's actually a new personal best that rock you see me go down it's actually deep i think it's about 60 feet yeah so i was there looking at that snapper try to get some footage for you guys <laughs> so yeah man so you see guys i'm improving so even though i'm i haven't shot anything big yet as in as in like it, such five six seven pound on the other hand, I improving on my diving, on my breath hold, on the depth with my ear pressure, because that's another thing. Um, I get more comfortable. I I go down better. So the, by the way, the free diving class helped me a lot of understanding to seamlessly, you know, doing a seamless enter into the water and go down without, you know, you using too much energy on that one so you can actually get more bottom time um so definitely the, the the free diving class helped me a lot and also in terms of understanding your breathing and filling your lungs and, and pack up your lungs with air and if you do that when you're down there now you slowly have more reserve to tap into which is different than just you know so and these are the pros right the free divers who do free diving as a sport that's all they do that's they that's all they want to achieve is is the longest breath hold and the deepest dive of course that's a little different because in spear fishing you are you are moving around while the free diver he tries to be as streamlined as possible to just reach the perfect depth so to say but definitely we can learn from their techniques when it comes to improving your breath hold um yeah and i mean there's two ways the, the fishermen are going out with they've been doing that for years every day you can improve like that of course you know but i want to improve faster because i'm not there every day i cannot dive so often so i i try to compensate with understanding more the technique aspect or side of the breath hold and that helps a lot i mean look if you see the fish that wait even too long Yo, I'm telling you, this I'm to NJ. I'm I'm just amazed going out with the guys because I don't know. They, I don't I don't know I don't know how to do it. They understand the sea like they understand it like it's their turf, it's their it's their ends like they know how where they possibly could be, where they should look, with, like 
I don't know. They just know. And so, yeah, so if you're not an experienced fisherman, you might go out there and not coming back with anything. It's not easy out there because I see some, I see guys, I see some videos from overseas YouTubers, divers lying down, looking at all those fishes like they choose which one they want to shoot. <laughs> I'm like, what the hell is this? They're there and they're just lying. Oh, should I, should I shoot both of them or maybe only one? I don't know what kind of paradise they're diving in, but that's not the case out here. Out here, you have to search for those big, big fishes. And that's why we shoot a lot of barracudas. Yeah. Yeah, man. Yeah, man. Am I talking too much diving or is it okay? <laughs> I'm glad you are with professional because there is a lot of danger in the ocean. Yeah, man, James. Absolutely. Um, that's another thing. Um they're very experienced divers and you know you will know because they always know where you are yeah right so if there's i mean I, there were many times where i needed assistance you know and they were right there so that makes that i feel very comfortable because i know if they got my back if you know so they're there like and even though everybody's on their hunt still they still have an idea where I'm at or where the next like person is so that if anybody needs assistance quickly for whatever reason you you're there very quick and that's very important because that yeah uh hey tanya greetings steven diving that deep pressure in the ears that's amazing yeah 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 sometimes the pressure i'm getting better i'm getting definitely i mean for a good while i could not de-block those ears i would like i and then once i maybe I have to blow harder so i was like gee <laughs> pop and 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 that worked so sometimes i was just shy with this popping and then i was like i was like what's going on here i want to go down and i just was like but even when you pop those ears like so hard it's energy you know because even those guys they ain't no popping no ears they'd be just like popped <laughs> if even that <laughs> Yeah, man, they, they want, I want to go to Pedro Bank. So it is um, definitely, I want to go there. But when I go there, I definitely want to like organize, organize such trip. Yeah, it's in, it's, I'm not, I don't know when, most likely in when we have better, better weather, like usually we have good sea um september october them time day i would love to arrange for such trip there are a lot of sharks as well <laughs> but yeah man i really want to go there i really want to go there yes people and we have 40 people in the live stream that is so cool thank you very much my light is still working last week it didn't work at all after 10 minutes it just went off so i guess tonight it's with me yeah man that's so cool um yeah salty locks you do you have a video with a file fish preparing file fish now that I prepared my file fish, I want to see how people prepare file fish. <laughs> ah, that's so cool. Yeah, man. Yeah, man. Lol, plus the coldness sometimes got me shivering after too long. Yes, yes, yes. Um, that's actually a, a good, a, another thing. I really, really, NJ, you see why? I need a, I need a, I need a three mil or maybe a five mil suit 
because that can affect your diving. Like if, if you if it gets to a state where you really cold, there's no way you can be performant actually in diving because it will affect your breath hold because if you're shivering there. <laughs> so as soon somebody actually comes to the island, I will try to get a three mil and maybe even a five mil wetsuit and prepare for the cold waters. Because I, I, hey, I mean, my, what I wear is like, it, it's not even, it's not a wetsuit. It's what I wear is, um, what do you call it? A rush guard is a rush guard. So they're very thin. I wear all of them. <laughs> I have, I wear three or four. I put all of them on. But again, as I said, I'm there eight hours sometimes and I'm, I still get cold at the end. And I'm there diving and then holding like this and then diving again and then hanging there and waiting like this. <laughs> hey, King Kalonji, greetings from Syracuse, New York. Greetings. No, but I'm going to do one with the trigger fish. Oh, nice. I look, I'm looking out for that one. You know, it was delicious. So the first time skinning one and then the first time preparing and it came out delicious. And, you know, I had the opportunity to actually shoot the second one. But because I wasn't sure, I was like, let me just work with one because I don't want to have, you know, a scenario like with the job. I had a job and it didn't taste nice at all. So I probably wouldn't even have. Well, I probably would have just not wasted, but yeah, I didn't want to waste the fish anyway. So I just shot one, but I should have really taken out both of them because it tastes good. <laughs> not cold in the islands. I wear only a short in the centers. Oh, well, no man, water can be, water can be cold here, especially in the winter months, January, February, March. We have cold waters. And again, it's the time you spend in the water. I'm okay if I just go in there half an hour, quick, quick, quick. But if you're there for a couple of hours, yo, that's no joke. You're getting cold. <laughs> yeah. So I, I, I try to get a wetsuit as soon as somebody's traveling to Jamaica and try to get one. Because... This, I don't enjoy this at all when I'm cold. I'm like there. And, ah, it's not nice. Axel, Jessica from Florida. Greetings, Saint Croix. Greetings, Darok. Hey, what's up? Greetings. Need the wetsuit to hold up. Yeah, man, definitely. NJ's back. Greetings. Yeah. very nice very nice so yeah that's what's up guys if you just tune in wow we gone an hour already hey give the video a like let me, i actually have tea around here so give it a like yep yeah. you know i i'm not having coffee tonight i'm having tea have to calm down my nerves <laughs> Oh, Rock City. All right. Interesting. I mean, hmm. I mean, no, no, it's it's much better. No, it's summer months. So, yeah, man, no summer months. Rush card is totally fine. Uh, but, man, we can have definitely some cold waters. Any any January, February, March, April waters, maybe all December, too. Yeah. But well, that's good to hear. But I mean, also probably the, it depends on the person because I still see some persons out there always with a t-shirt, and I'm like, "You're not cold?" No. Nope. <laughs> so yeah, Gaza boy, greetings. What's up? Yeah, but I just love it, man. I love the ocean world. It's so beautiful, mesmerizing, and you know, when you see like a nice turtle or a stingray or, ah, oh, this is just so cool. 
You remind me of my sister. She's vegetarian. Yeah, man, I'm 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 pescatarian. That's cool. So pescatarian is yeah, we eat we we eat fish, but we don't eat we don't eat meat. Yes, yes, yes. So yeah, man. Uh, hey guys, uh, we have still 47 people in the live stream. That is so cool. Thank you very much. Pick up yourself. I'm happy that you guys are all here joining the live stream. I appreciate you guys so much. So I just want to thank you for the support, for tuning in on a Thursday night. Remember, actually, this live stream is every Thursday at 7.30. Unless I'm somewhere where there's no network, then I would have to, you know, postpone it. But so far, I think that only happened one time. So I'm pretty regular. Even next week when i traveling, I really try to, I cannot promise, but I will let you know. If I'm there, then definitely I'll let you know. But if I have to postpone it, you will know. But I definitely try, even if I'm traveling next week, to have the live stream and so we can connect you guys can ask questions we can talk we can you know chill and have a good evening and a vibesy evening and all of that yay so saltilox where are you going next what's the plan on your weekend you get to go diving Yes, guys, let me know. What are, what are you guys doing on the weekend? What do you, what's your plans? Yeah, so I hope we get... We, actually, the sea wasn't that good over the past days. I was lucky to get that day last week because it was murky and there was some strong currents and I like this no I'm not joking if there's a current I'm out <laughs> well sometimes you don't know but most times if I get to know or if I can actually I don't know no 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 currents for me uh that's rip current Jesus I'm not diving I'm working on the boat oh got to keep it maintains okay nice nice cool what kind of boat rock city so rock city when you say saint thomas you mean saint thomas in jamaica or the island of saint thomas Because my girl Salty Lock said in St. Thomas, that's a great place to go diving. At 60 feet. Ooh, nice. Oh my God. That's a nice place to work on a speedboat. I will be just speeding around. <laughs> and Salty Lock's running. Oh, Rock City. Yes, I forgot. Look at this. Uh, now it's registered. Yeah, man. Oh, my God. Yeah, I, I forgot. <laughs> Saint Croix. Greetings. Oops. Battery low. Did I bring the charger? So, yeah, I just I just realized I I um I I I did not realize it. <laughs> but now now I know. Oops, did I just do that? Uh oh. Is this my fault? Come back. Bing. <laughs> yeah, I need the batteries low. Oh no, is this the wrong charge I brought in? <laughs> it's one big go every day drop some big fish in different spots. Ooh, nice. All right, there we go. 
Loki. <laughs> yeah, peeps. I need to charge this here. Da da. All right, we're back in the game. Yeah, man. Um. So what next? Um. So yeah. Santa Cruz. All right. Guys, next week is my, is it next week? I mean, the other week, the 24th of June is my birthday. So you can write it down and then be like, happy birthday, Jess. <laughs> I'm celebrating the entire month. Like right now, if there's anything I want or see, it's like, it's your birthday month. It's your birthday month. <laughs> so, you know, in July, you... I don't even know if you guys are going to see me in July because I'll be just at home and not going nowhere. Because probably I've been splurging too much this month that I'll be just home and looking at a wall. <laughs> you should go to Little Bay. Little Bay. Where, where, where is Little Bay? Uh, Devon. It's fun to be able to go wherever and drop ones of big fish. Yo, that must be dream. That's like, that sounds so dream life. Hmm. Is there any time exciting? Is there anything exciting on the West side? West end? Yeah, man. Apps. Oh, yeah, 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 yeah. West end. I mean, you mean James, like specific to diving or just generally? My birthday is next Tuesday. Nice. Yes. June, baby. <laughs> Up to the time. Can see. Greetings. Yeah. There's a couple of very cool stuff. Um, things to see. Things to do. West End is a vibe. It's a vibe. Now the lobster season is closed. But what I love to do is going on booby k and have you know those lobster roasted on the island i love that um they have rick's cafe you have blue hole there's actually a blue hole in the grill um i have a video about it on my channel i love it it's so cool like jumping down blue hole yep You'll be in air for a while. You'll be like, oops. <laughs> and then you just jump in this blue hole. <laughs> yeah. Actually, that the blue hole in the grill is really a blue hole because we have a blue hole in, in Portland and in St. Anne. But when it comes to, like, yeah, it's like you, you, you jump in almost down into a cave yeah so i think that's an exciting thing to do over there in the grill and then like we mentioned earlier um benta river and mayfield and roaring river all very nice river and they're all like an hour and a bit maybe driving from the grill so these are things um people can do when staying in the grill Tenzin, greetings. Nice, thank you. Andre, Maxi, bless up. That is so cool. Guys, I have a question because I don't know if it's just really a... I mean, I know it's a global thing somewhat, but I don't know if it's like extreme in Jamaica or is it like everywhere? Guys, where you are, have the prices also increased? And I'm not just talking about like gas prices, like food, like supermarket, like tripled, quadrupled. Where you are, is that the same where you are in your country? Because Jamaica right now is going crazy. Like, I'm like, hello, what's going on? What's going on here? <laughs> is this, is this like... Is this happening where you are? Randy, hello, greetings, Randy Frost. 
let me know guys everything gone up here let me know which country you are in and if yes because i've seen people just saying of gas price which yes it that that every week you know it's 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 out of hand but like just food food supermarket anywhere all the items and not just a couple of cents like <laughs> quadruple <laughs> I just sent my mother two bar. It gone way up, right? Um, honestly, I'm very happy you 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 could send her a barrel. Trust me, it's 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 a great help if you like pick up yourself. You know, it's really really right now. It's crazy. Rent gone up, yeah. Boston here, absolutely terrible inflation. All right. Yeah, because I'm wondering. I mean, I was like, is this Jamaica? Because yeah, I I mean, I know just as just the phenomenon of being an island, we get certain things. Certain things might affect us more because we have to just import a lot. But <laughs> like, yo, it's it's. Um, I don't know. Then finally, what is your ideal birthday? Diving and beach feast and nature hike in the mountains with Blue Mountain Hospitality. My ideal perfect birthday is diving, catch and cook. That is, that's me. Yeah. If I can dive on my birthday and do a catch and cook, I, I will go for it. I love it. Um, but if I don't get to dive, then definitely some outside, outdoor, nature, and like river, mountain, anything. Like I love it. So I'm actually going to be traveling on my birthday. So I'm planning on diving. But again, that's something you can't really plan because I don't know what the sea will be like in that week. So. Hopefully, I get good sea and I can go diving. Yeah. Mm. Yeah. Oh my God. On my birthday, I just want to be in the water, in my element, in my favorite element. <laughs> yeah. That's, you know, that's my happy place. 10 Z, oh yeah, I mean gas price, rent, and 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 food, just basic items, man. Love me, growing. I'm here in the United States. It's ridiculous. The food, auto gas, and property tax. Pat Horas. All right, all right, okay. So it is you okay? It's not just here, because <laughs> I was like, I don't get it. Like it's too much. <laughs> So we we basically we in a can we say we're in a depression basically? I mean it's depressing. <laughs> so we're in a depression. <laughs> oh man, we went right, we went straight to depression. <laughs> I bet Hawaii is outrageous. Ooh, yeah. I mean, so the, no, that's the thing, like places which already were here like already were on a very high i mean jamaica was already expensive and hawaii i think as well because what i heard it's crazy over there so with all this what's happening now it's just gone through the through the roof <laughs> hey jess even dollar tree price here in america gone up from one dollar to 125 Ah, uh, you see, fresh, yes, it's a broker thing. Yes, price in Chicago, seven dollar. No way. What? Seven dollars? No. That what, man, James? Seven dollars? Jesus. Chicago, I feel, I feel low. 
Whoa. So we can cry together. <laughs> because just like, what are we going to do? <laughs> Yo, guys, man. Oh. Bless her from New Zealand. T Roy, greetings. I know, right? Where have you been? Where have you been? Damn, yeah, man. Randy says when Katrina hit our gas went to five. Then there was a hose market fall. Lots couldn't pay the rent and mortgage. Get ready for that next. Yeah, man, Randy. Right now. That's what we anticipate because at this like it's just a matter of time now. What's my what? Is that something to do with diving, Yuri? <laughs> if it has nothing to do with diving, I'm not there. <laughs> See, apparently it's all government trying to get back all the taxes they losing during COVID. Yeah. Yeah, I guess definitely. So I like just everything together, the war, the the in Ukraine, then the the effects of the pandemic, you know, and it, it it's it's crazy. It's crazy. Can see you love me Honda and Toyota. Yeah, 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 yeah. Definitely. If you have a, a fuel efficient car, then that's great right now. Very great. I should be driving a Tesla. I heard they are very fuel efficient. <laughs> Can I get a Tesla? <laughs> Do you ever go to Bass Pro Shop? Devon, what's that? Where is that? Randy, hey, how are you guys? I love you. Dallas, Texas, greetings, Randy. Nice to hear. Big up yourself. That's so cool. Gem and I can give you thanks for the live. Up full and cup full. Yay, up full and cup full. Right? You saying it? Up full and cup full. Cheers. By the way, guys, I, I kind of forget to say it, but this is available on the merch store and you can buy it. I will leave the link after this live stream in the in the in the description. So if you want to have a nice cup like this, so you can drink your, your coffee in the morning and just, you know, say, yeah, man, I love it. <laughs> yeah. It will just make your day. So, yeah, you need a cup like that. <laughs> yeah, man. Randy, greetings again. Big up. Are you glad you're on live? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Every Thursday we have a live stream right here connecting talking um always at 7 30 every thursday yeah even when i'm traveling next week i try to be here i'll do my best <laughs> oh t roy that's so cool thank you so much oh nice yay T tell him hi from me Watching anything from Jamaica makes my day. Oh, Randy, nice, nice. Randy, you you are from Jamaica, and if so, where in Jamaica? I saw you on Moko and I say I must say link that Empress. Ah, King Kalonji, big of yourself. Yeah, yeah. You know, it's a real nice river retreat up there. And, you know, escaping the city, I mean, it's just nice. And and their vibes, like, they just, Ratia and Moko is, is a whole vibe. It's just it's very cool. And I actually really enjoy learning, the, the learning about the farming, even though I know I'm not going to be farming, really, because I realized it needs a lot of time. <laughs> but maybe, like, you never know. You never know. You know, but maybe one day I have some land and I can do some farming and I have the time and all of that. You never know. But even like just the, the farm to table, I love that lifestyle. I just love it. 
it's just a way to go and if you have that possibility yo just go to the farm and cut where you want and then cook it definitely way to go uh yes we are in recession worse than 2008 James, I think we, we skipped recession. I think we went to depression. <laughs> this feels like a depression. <laughs> because, and it's not even like, it seems like just the beginning. So, uh, anyway, guys, we have to stay positive And we have to just find ways of surviving this, right? I just have to shoot more fish. <laughs> <laughs> uh, yes, market. Very smart. Very smart. Yep. You made a way the world is going, you know. Yes, love Ratia Moko. Definitely. See now freelance truck is place got two new cabins now. But so book out. Oh nice, really. I didn't even follow up. Why didn't you see that? Hmm. That's so cool. I love the river over there. I, I had so much things to do. I want to go there again. Um, I, honestly, the, the river by, by Freelance Turkey, I think that river is one of my favorite. Yeah, Swift River is a whole vibe. It's so beautiful. Oh, man. And when I, you know, he was like, yeah, 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 you know, you just go up and there is a river and you will see it. But okay, you know, I took the bicycle and I did not I did, I did not expect to find such a beautiful spot. It's beautiful with that rock in the middle. And there's a video, by the way. Yeah. Um, and we did a busu soup that day. And no, I didn't do a busu soup. That was uh, okay. First, I was at Chucky's. I discovered, I discovered the place for myself. And then later on, I went back and we did a busu video at Swift River. Yeah, no, no, that isn't. Um, Randy, yes, believe that Ja will make a way, right? Right, we just got to believe it. And, and that's the thing with belief, you know. Believe is a funny thing. Believe is really something, sometimes you just have to hold on to it, no matter what. Like you don't let down your belief and you just have faith even if things not looking that way or not seem to go that way. You have to walk in faith the same way and believe that things will work out one, or, one way or the other. Yeah, man. Yeah, man, definitely. T-Roy, that would be so cool. Yes. I, no, this over there, that's a little paradise. It's so beautiful. It was cold, though. <laughs> when was I? I would think, when was I here? Why? I don't know. Must be maybe December last year. It was so cold. The river was so cold. I, like, I wanted to dive because we were diving for Busu. I couldn't even hold my breath. That's how cold the water was. I was like, <gasps> like, uh, you know, like, 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 <laughs> you know, yeah, like your heart just stands still. <laughs> but then I was like, we need bussus, or right, girl, get those bussus. <laughs> we need lunch. I think gas prices will go up to ten a gallon by September. Oh, man. We all gonna, we all gonna, we all should go and, and, and get a donkey or a horse and like boogies. <laughs> or bicycle. Actually, that wouldn't be bad. Honestly, if Jamaica wouldn't be such a, how do I say no? Not the safest place to ride bicycle. Then I definitely probably would just use my bicycle bicycle and go to work. Yeah. But that wouldn't be safe here. Bicycle in Kingston? Nah. <laughs> yeah, man, a horse. I need a horse. Uh, 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 and start just horse riding. 
When the next time you're going to Rust Kitchen? Um, I think more likely maybe in August. Them timely because this month I'm already traveling. I won't be here for basically month done. And then in July, I that's already booked out in July. So August, hopefully. The Royal entered the chat. Greetings. How are you? Big up yourself. Yeah, man. How was your day, the Royal? The Royal General. Paul, greetings. Good night. yeah i believe yeah man and we have is the food really that good yes i mean all right so people sometimes think you know i think what did i have only one time i had but that, you guys would know because i wasn't vlogging <laughs> you know it was so lala and um but also it was late it was cold because I, I i arrived late at night and so it was like okay you know not special um but first you know i'm already somebody eating for health so i'm not necessarily when i cook usually i don't cook for taste i cook for health right so i'm very low like i have not big expectation once it's green it's healthy i am happy so i understand for maybe somebody it could be that he might not enjoy the the, the natural cooking you know but me a nice plate of fresh callaloo from the garden with some boiled banana i love it that i love it you know so yeah it's good and it's really because I don't eat meat. I only eat vegetables. There's not really much you can, you know, do wrong. <laughs> so obviously it's good for me because what we, we all eat, we eat the cabbage, great, lovely cabbage with, with ground provision and salt fish. And then the eggplant the other day. Yes, it maybe didn't look so good, but it tastes delicious. Actually, when I went home, I redid that dish with the eggplant. And it was really nice. So, yeah, yeah. To me, I enjoy the food. It's good. You know, farm to table. I understand where the food is coming from. And I just love that concept. So, yeah, man. Yes, Ida Cooper. That's kind of what's up. Um, and, you know, several times, actually, it, it was if, like the guests. I think I saw we did the guests. They were like, mm, you know, it's really nice. And it's not just me. Like, <laughs> you could say, oh, she, she just likes everything. <laughs> but the, again, for me to say, yuck, that takes a lot. Yeah. You know, I, I, you, I'm not, I don't know where, I, I don't know. I mean, even for respect to the chef, you know, I'm not, I don't know. I, I, I really, for me to say yuck, it, it, it has to be really yuck. <laughs> but otherwise I'm very low, low, like low maintenance when it comes to food. Um, I'm enjoying it. I, I, so to me it's good. He cooks so healthy. I want to visit his kitchen. I'm going to plan it. Yeah, man, definitely. You know, and you see, understanding food, understanding the health, you, you approach, you approach food differently, I think, you know. So, and, you know, so he knows I'm vegetarian, so he will prepare a vegetarian dish, but he, he will cook chicken. I mean, there's, on his channel, he shows chicken dish and chicken meals. So he cooks that as well. He, so depending on the guests, we are there. 
and um so yeah man usually you just cater for everybody i must say your inspiration to a lot of us yeah bless one love stay with love love the key and keep bringing these beautiful vibes and vlogs thank you so much t roy big up yourself thanks for always joining in supporting i really appreciate you all i vibes day was okay sometime usual hope it was iry yeah man the Roy, my day was okay well so so i went to the dentist so you know what that mean that means ching 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 so i don't know <laughs> so horrible and i have to go back tomorrow <sighs> I basically work for the dentist so that's what's happening here anyway so i go jamaica anglers fishing greetings aka jack magnet is here big up yourself that's so cool yeah hopefully i can come join you um not this month but maybe next month i would love to join you on another line fishing trip yeah I want to, I really want to be able to do that. Jack. <laughs> that must just be a super cool feeling to have something on the hook, you know? I said, like, what? Yeah, man. So cool. I really enjoy, you know, exploring other ways of fishing. So spear fishing, of course. So I did a deep line fishing. Oh, speaking of deep line fishing, I'm so overdue to visit lock and load. Yes. I, we've been talking like since a year now. We've been saying, when are we linking up again with lock and load for another deep sea fishing adventure? So I really enjoy like the other ways of fishing as well, like just seeing how it is um it's cool it's cool doesn't jamaica have free health care like england canada well yes but you know the you know you know that means it's it's not the best you know it's not the best the public the public hospital here is is not the best is not the best and you will be just if you can avoid it and if you can somewhat you know i mean i don't know for now i still manage to actually have an insurance for now, I still can pay my insurance, so that's good. It's paid for this year, so thanks God. But they still don't cover everything, so you just have to. But they allow me kind of to pay in in installments, so that's good. Um, but yeah, usually if you go there, they will just take out your tooth. Like you know, they will be like, "All right, tooth out. That's it. Bye." You know, they because usually that's just what's there they not they will not try to <laughs> fix that um so yeah but i can't take out that too because then they then they this one is gone already so if it's this gone to know that not good <laughs> yep i do this and this sir what surf casting of the beach i do this in the no, that surf surf casting oh nice tiro that's so cool that's why the starting back reload ah get the travel insurance trust me okay i took that on-way ticket to vegas got here monday and 1 a.m and i love it already oh barefoot travel for real that's so cool yo when you're there you know they have these roller coasters on the rooftop make sure you check those out they are like they they have certain um roller coaster they throw you out and you on a skyscraper and you'll be there like hanging down and then they pull you back and it's <laughs> all some crazy stuff yes man we did all of those when we were in vegas yeah <laughs> guys when i was an athlete back in the days i went there for the u.s open and that was in um in vegas so 
after the competition, we went just on all of the rides. And we went, and so there's a thing they called it re-ride. So if you what if you paid for a ride, you actually could go on a re-ride for free. Re-ride, re-ride, re-ride. <laughs> oh man, that was a good time. That was a good time. I get you. I'm in Canada and we have seriously long waits for most treatments. Exactly. And so this was an emergency because actually the, the thing fell out my my crown so i can't wait i can't you know and that's just the problem like yeah public they will be like take it out bye girl you know <laughs> because it's cost so and they they know it's it's that's not covered so you are you either have a way to pay it or you have that's it just have to wait yeah <laughs> kenroy greetings oh fish rod right tira yaman yeah, cool Watkins, greetings. Seda, do you live in Jamaica? Yes, I live in Jamaica, actually. Yeah, man. Yes, Seda. Same way here. Free mean take tooth out. Money mean fix tooth. Same, right? Exactly. But depending on your situation, we'd want to. Yeah, that might be a solution. They will just take it out. But depending on, in my case, no. Yeah, be cheap. I talk with no tooth. <laughs> yes, we have me without without tooth. <laughs> um, problem is, I came here with a backpack and no dollars. My friends will take me on some adventure, though. Ah, okay. Well, I wish you good luck. Maybe you can win some money. <laughs> Hey, sometimes you you walk past the casinos there and it just go ching 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 ching. And the people are not even faced, like it's a regular thing. And it goes ching 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 ching. And I was like, wow, are you not freaking out? You just want a lot of money. But it seems like they are so addicted that it's like, yeah, we're just gonna put it back in. <laughs> that same money, we just play again. It's like, wow, that's interesting. Yeah, what kids? Yeah, I lost my crown, exactly. <laughs> Oh man, mm -hmm. I have to go. Oh my god, mm. no, it's 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 it's. I don't want to even think about it. I'm not gonna think about it. I'm just gonna pray about it. Yes. A solutions shall come. <laughs> Good evening to you from Long Island, New York, and fry fish and bread in the kitchen. Ooh, nice. Balmain, that sounds good. See that shout out from New Jersey. See that, thank you. Tyrone Davies, speak up yourself, Jessica. We met in Long Bay, Portland. Tyrone, Tyrone, yeah. When? Um, when, when we met? Garfield, greetings from the UK. Yeah, man. Actually, actually, um, Barefoot Travel, my friend, she won, she won money. Like she, I won money, but that I won, the money I won was from the competition and she won her money in the casino. So we had money. <laughs> We spent it all. <laughs> oh, we, we, we bought a ticket. So, you know, they, they're, on the, they're on the street selling you stuff. And we just won money in Las Vegas. Like, you'd be like, ah, money. So they were selling these tickets with a helicopter to go to the Grand Canyon. And we were like, yeah. And they were like picking up in the limousine from your hotel. I you know. We... I don't know. We 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 had a good time. So we went there, spent all that money, took that helicopter because who like we don't know if we ever will be back in Vegas. So we went all out. But it was amazing. Yo, Grand Canyon on the helicopter, it was beautiful. Oh my god, it was very impressive. And then we had breakfast on the Grand Canyon. 
the helicopter was part of the package they brought this little thingy and then you had a little table there the helicopter landed and then there was this snack box for everybody um yeah <laughs> Garfield, the morning from the UK. My wife loves the channel. Thank you so much. Big her up. Tell her hi. Hi. <laughs> Aladi. Jessica, I watch you, Lowers Lane. All right. Thank you. Greetings today. You are your channel. Um, Lady loves you. Yellow fun. Yeah, man, definitely. We we vibe in there. Absolutely. I'm afraid of that. I see on land, no air. Tipping. <laughs> and Las Vegas is, is a Babylon trap. Spend money to get there. Spend money to stay. Absolutely. Absolutely. Like, it. I mean, it's, it's, it's these things, you know. You've seen it. You've done it. You had, I mean, we had fun. It was really fun. Um, it was impressive. Like, it's, it's, it's like a toy city. You do, I, I don't know. And probably, if you go back now, it, you probably if I go if I would go back, probably I wouldn't even recognize it again. It, it seems like they build buildings by the week. <laughs> Nathaniel Rodriguez, greetings. So yes, people, we'll do we coming to jail next month nice going lower sleep on the pelican bar yes that's so cool yeah man you're gonna have a great time that the view in lower sleep is just amazing and depending on if if you physically fit i suggest if you physically fit you do the hike down lower sleep it's not easy hey hold on chaka 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 you see, it's a fun, it's a fun, it's a party. Hold on, hold on, hold on, guys. I got it, I got it, I got a super chat. Remember, the thoughts create our state of existence and quality of your experience here on earth. Therefore, be responsible for everything you create, being responsible. By the way, you think, stay blessed, everyone, keep shining. Oh, that is so cool. The word of inspiration right here, James Allen Cooper. Thank you so much. I appreciate you. Thank you for high five. Watch your high five. Check. I love it. Yeah, man. Pick up yourself. Thank you so much. Guys, guys, you make my day. I mean, <laughs> when, when I had to go to the dentist, I, I was more near crying than laughing. But today, you guys made my night. Yeah, man. Thank you so much. You see? You see, you guys are so cool. James, thank you so much. And that is really a nice thought um, for this evening so thank you gracias danke <laughs> i love the way educate jamaicans turn on turn what turn on and off pato <laughs> thank you seems like a money scam hits to see oh you mean las vegas dosi dos Again, you know, I had a competition there. So we were there for the tournament and we, you know, we, we like, like always, you know, athletes, we, we were, we were there uh, making the best of, of usually every country we had to visit for, for tournaments. You then, you know, you try to get, see the place a little bit because you're in the sports hall all day and you really try and you feel like, you know, you just deserve it. After so much training and training and training, and when the competition is done, you really say like, you know what? No, you know, you want to see the place if you get to see it. Um, so all that was like, yeah, let's go to Grand Canyon. <laughs> oh, yeah, man. I love channel like this one. I love the positivity vibes. Oh, thank you so much, King Kalonji. You know, this is really what I appreciate here. So we can have, even if the day was not going well, we can just come here, you know, and, and reason, have a good time. And, hey, what can we do? We have to just keep the faith, walk in faith. And just also like James said, you know, it's a quality of thoughts. And 
especially when things not going well, that is when your thoughts have to make sure you don't allow, like you block anything negative. You just have to say it will get better or the solution will come your way. And you always have to think solution, think solution. Whatever it is, focus on the solution. Yeah. Yeah, I'm talking. Huh? <laughs> What type of tournament? So that was a uh, martial arts. So I was a martial art athlete for many, many years. I was in the national team competing, fighting. <laughs> yeah, right? I was in some sports, which is, I don't know, not the most, maybe not the most feminine. <laughs> oh, maybe that's why I love pink. But yeah, I don't know. I, I like martial arts. I love martial arts. Like that's my first passion. Like, yeah, man, martial arts, um, karate to be more specific. Yeah. Um, so yeah, I was in the national team and with the national team, we were traveling around. I was chasing those medals. Yeah. But now I'm a passionate diver. <laughs> yeah man hey david adventure pick up yourself greetings guys look who is here david aka young studs yes so if you know you probably know young studs so he changed his name so now it's david adventure head over there check out his channel right here in the chat check out his channel david adventure and subscribe and leave a little comment and a lot of amazing stuff happening over there so now so you see where i learned the cooking is david yeah i'm the assistant chef <laughs> that's where the real cooking is happening is over there man yes people david adventure go and check it out jamaica angles fishing just I, yeah man aka jack magnet man hey yo jamaican anglers i wish i i i can't wait on the day i can actually shoot a big jack the way you catch catch them with the line i can't wait on the day or actually when i join you on the next fishing trip i wouldn't mind to actually catch one on the line that would that could work as well yeah and the only positive thoughts here please people no negativity love your energy jess motivate a lot of us yeah man angela forbes absolutely jess what's up missy missy art can't wait if you come home yeah, come look here you're gone way too long now come back <laughs> yes yes um i i guys i when when was i before pandemic i left to where was I in Canada? Not even a week, and I felt homesick already. I can't even I can't even travel again for long, and I want to come back. So, David, I feel you. So you must be already homesick and say you oh, want come home. Um, yeah, man, and we you know so much adventures to do. So, spear fishing and catch and cook. You know, even Wilkes. You know, long I haven't. Been looking for Wilkes and get a nice go to Wilkes soup. As a matter of fact, that's the first thing we probably have to do again. Go and get, get some Wilkes and do a nice natural Wilkes soup like we did um, with Lee's on Lee's birthday. Guys, on Lee's birthday, we on her birthday, we were looking for Wilkes and then we cooked the, the soup all natural, no form of seasoning, nothing like natural coconut juice and the wilks and the everything needs people that soup was so delicious sometimes we all forget what real ingredients taste like because we are so used to adding seasoning a lot of seasoning and sometimes it's not necessary yep not true david <laughs> you're gonna catch on the next adventure all right jamaican anglers I know you're the jack magnet. So if I stand next to you with my line, I'm I'm positive that this that I'll catch something. I'm 100% sure. <laughs> so 
look out for my call. I soon, probably next month or so, I'm going to give you a call so we can go fishing. Lovelle. Whoa, Miss Cargay, you look so nice. Thank you. Thank you. Because when I came home, I was like, girl, you look so tired. <laughs> yeah, man. Thank you so much. From Guadeloupe. Bonsoir. Big up yourself, miss. I follow you in Paris. Really? Oh, you saw the YouTube video in Paris or you was in Paris? Oh, my God. Yeah, man. Paris, that was the World Championship in 2000. Oh, my God. When was that? 12? Yeah. So I lost in semifinals to the French girl. We were in Paris. I lost to her. And then I could go to repercharge. Um, and then in the repercharge for third place, I lost. Yeah, sad. I lost against Japan. Um referee decision so none no i didn't score she didn't score so the referee will choose and then they gave it to japan therefore i became fifth on that world championship yeah sad I was crying for weeks <laughs> oh my god i was like what i was so close to a world medal man 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 yeah almost home wheel soup natural with coconut yeah man david can't wait yep can cook with natural ingredients i'm in paris okay yeah nice 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 bonjour de de, de paris that's so cool nice yes you have to catch a jack jack on <laughs> yeah fish on jack on absolutely hey being subscribed to you just and he's from paris yeah man yeah man yeah man from paris that's so cool you watch all my oh merci beaucoup ça c'est trop cool king uh, fifth in the world is great i mean yeah king absolutely now now that i calm down and i look back on my my career as an athlete i'm like girl this is good you know but when it just happened you just pissed because that's really you do all you you actually do the same amount of fights you do all you do everything and you actually go home empty so that's kind of the i don't know uh, it's a hard pill to place fifth yeah <laughs> yeah yeah but i got my medal after that so i was so like oh my god but then i got the i got so i got the european champions i'm european champion so i got after that there was um the european championship yeah man i got that one so made it up <laughs> bonsoir oui bonsoir du guadadada guadalupe guadalupe ça c'est trop cool merci beaucoup pour pour ton support j'aime bien j'adore c'est trop cool it's a long time I haven't spoken French, so yeah. <laughs> hey, Jamaican Angus fishing. I have so many fishing rod. I have two for Jess and you bring us to the good. Hey, David. Yeah, man. We're gonna link up with Jamaican Angus when you're back. Absolutely. So Jamaican Angus David is now also got the bug into uh, line fishing. So he's all and um about it now. So. Yo, David, that's going to be a link up right there. Pick up all Jamaican people. Yeah, man. Guadeloupe, pick up yourself. That is really cool. Um, so, strategies. Da -da -dee -da -da -da. So guys, again, I'll show you right here. That is David Adventure here. You can see him. Go check out his channel. Right. He's currently overseas, but coming back to Jamaica soon. So you can look out for some lot of adventures, cooking adventures, fishing adventures, everything. Merci. Yes, I'm coming from Guadeloupe, French Caribbean island. Oui, ça c'est trop cool. 
you unbox the rod case. All ah, right, cool, cool. Merci, voilà. Hey guys, again, so cool that you all tuned in, spent the evening with me. You made my night. I really love it. Hold on, because I love it. <laughs> So we gonna, we gonna, hold on. I was just about to say bye, but somebody just bought another five minutes. <laughs> so I'm gonna just stay here, keep up the good work and please shout out my wife on the next video. Her name is Mel. Greetings, Mel from the UK, right? Garfield Taylor, big up yourself. Send a super chat. Mel, big up yourself. This is so nice. Yay. So Mel is, is watching now or she's not watching, working or something. Is she here? Carfield, Mel is here. Mm-hmm. No, she's sleeping. Ooh, yeah, don't wake her up. <laughs> okay, yeah, because it's it's morning. I don't know what morning, like two, three o'clock or something. You just finished work. Ooh, so late. Wow. That's late. Because it's what time? Two, three o'clock in the morning or something? So yes, guys, actually, I haven't been doing, um, I, I try to every now and then do a early live stream so that people in Europe can actually join. Um, so then I would, I, would, I would do a live stream in the day, so it would be evening in Europe, and they could actually also join in every now and then a live stream um that's actually a good reminder so definitely i try to put in an early live stream soon for for the the time zone of europe i would love to come and hang out with moko you and rati i have all my own equipment no problem to be on moko how do we do it i'm from michigan usa um you know he has if I'm best the best is you check out his website raskitchen.com on his website you will have the the link to his airbnb and that's the best way to go about it your book your stay with the link which is on his website it will bring you to his airbnb and then you can look at um at the availability and and you can book your stay you know how Airbnb works. Once you, once you actually book, the contact number will show. So you won't get actually a contact number until you book. So once you place the booking, the Moco's contact will be there, and you can start a conversation on you know pick up and how and what and all these things. Um, hey hold on emil oh my god this is so cool oh i love you guys <laughs> hey i got a super chat i have five super chat i love it where's my i love it cup cheers yeah man emil pick up yourself i appreciate the support thank you so much ah you know, uh, to be honest, at one point this evening when I came home, I was like, I'm tired. And I wasn't like, because of this damn dentist, I was like, <laughs> just go to bed. <laughs> and then I'm like, no, 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 I can't. I, I, my subscribers are waiting for my live stream. So I have to go and do my live stream. So I'm so glad I came on my live stream, people. Yes. You see, this is so cool. I really appreciate you people. Uh, Calvin, I just got, sorry, I'm late. For the happy class. <laughs> <laughs> Guys, Calvin calls this the happy class. 
Uh, this is so cool. This is so cool. We do happy class no matter what, right? Inflation going crazy. We, we keep in our happy class. <laughs> ah, this is so cool. Uh, love, BNB. B and B Airbnb Yemen um yes and and you will also see the availability it has different different cabins and you can book so you can place your booking and then you're good to go Yemen yeah, and he, you can even arrange pick up with him because he has a van now and all of that so that's pretty cool Yeah, man. Also, I'm um, in Kingston and it's very hot. The, va the fan is um, here. <laughs> Kingston hot. <laughs> Yo, sun is out in Kingston, man. I already missing the, the sea breeze from uh, Portland. Mo Dollar, hello. Greetings to you as well. Yes, people, and we gone two hours, and this is wow. And we have 43 people in the live stream. Remember to give this live stream a like, that would be amazing. Um, yeah, <laughs> and um, wow, we gone two hours, people. This is so cool, you know. Sometimes, especially in the beginning, before I did live stream, I was like two hours oh my god this is so long but i'm going to talk for two hours and then when i started the live stream and then i realized i'm like whoa two hours just passed like this you know because you guys are cool <laughs> you guys are super cool so we having a good time and it's actually just flowing this is amazing yeah man yes people i became a fan favorite oh uh, thank you so much that's so cool i definitely appreciate you all logging on and 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 spending the evening with me on a thursday remember if you just tune in i'm having this live stream every thursday at 7 30 and then we just hang out, we talk. There's usually, I um, never really have a topic because I kind of let you guys lead in the sense of the questions and then that's just the direction it will go and we just talk, whatever, you know? Um, yeah, so usually there's no topic specific. We just chill. <laughs> yes. Um, and so far, this has been going great. I can't wait to tune in next time. Keep up the positive vibes. Yeah, man, King Kalonji, big up yourself. Thanks for tuning in. Appreciate it. Guys, thank you so much. I'm slowly, slowly starting, um, closing the live stream. Good night, beautiful. May God bless you with all your realities. Emil, same to you. God bless you too. Keep safe and thank you so much for the support. And hopefully I see you back next week, same time, 7.30. Guys, keep safe. Oh, Marlene, yeah, man, actually about to close off the live stream. We gone two hours. I had a fantastic time with all this cool. I just have cool subscribers. You guys rock. I had planned a camping expedition to Glacier National Park, but it was diffused because of the pandemic. I've been to Jamaica two times in the grill, and I love it. Jamaica would be better. Wow. Lovell, that sounds like super cool. Wow, I hope you can um, know that things are more likely back to normal. You can actually do that expedition. That sounds like a real cool expedition. Um. To the national park ah uh, yeah negril is absolutely a vibe i love it i can't wait to go back to negril miss cinnamon good night guys i'm slowly closing this chat so thanks again for tuning in i absolutely love you guys i love the support i i appreciate it and thank you
<laughs> so beers though in last year oh beers hmm because i i think these parks they 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 sell these defense sprays or whatever for beers and these things i think they have like a kit where they give you i saw that the other day from another youtuber so yeah but the ah man that must be so beautiful to go to the national park yeah i think that's something i would definitely like as well all right guys so again thanks very much i'm gonna close this chat thank you thank you thank you and look out for my next video. It will come, um, today's what? Thursday. Hopefully, hopefully Monday or Sunday. Let's see. Hopefully, just look out for it. Look out for it. It depends. I'm not sure how fast I can edit my next video. Um, but yeah, look out for it. And uh, yeah, and that's a wrap. I catch you next week, same time. Take care, take care and keep safe. And that's a wrap. Bye. Hold on, I have to read the last one. Emil said, I said realities because dreams come only to people who sleep. Ah, got you, right? And we're not sleeping, we are living the reality. Yes, man, you're so right. You're so right. You are so right. And with that said, I'm logging out. Emil, pick up yourself. Bye, people. Bye-bye. Bye. -bye. Bye.